Hello everyone, I'm Sarah Wiseman and today we have our Divine Astrology April 2023 forecast. Um, please subscribe, those will come every month and annually. I've been doing this forecast for a long time so it's a pretty fun way to get some advice for what's going to be happening in the time frame ahead. You can also go to sarahwiseman.com and you can subscribe and sign up there. So again, for April 2023, our channeled forecast is this very interesting, super interesting topic, actually, that um, I've been receiving a lot of information about in my channeling and meditation process. And here is what the guides would like to say now. And again, this is part of a much bigger discussion that's been coming forward. Calibrating to now. The soul exists in now. When our mind starts running around in all the circles, we can take a pause and become aware of present moment, what is actually happening now. What's actually happening? What's actually occurring? What is the true present situation? What is the real reality here? Now, it's very interesting because we can be in many realities at once. There's never any one reality. There's always another dimension. And yet we can find nowness wherever we are. So much of this work we do is in etheric realms. When we journey, we're traveling in time, space, matter, and other dimensional realities. And yet it's never hard to sense what is now. So in this work, we are asked to seek soul truth. We might clearly see what happened in the past. We might reveal what has been hidden. We might see the truth in a clouded situation. We can see energetically, emotionally, spiritually, karmically, and dimensionally. So even as we are journeying in time and space within many dimensions all at once, we are always seeking present moment awareness of the time, space, or dimension we are in. We are always seeking the truth of now. We can always be here now, wherever now is. When we are walking in the forest, we can find now. When we are in meditation, we can find now. Now is always now. And when you mix things up dimensionally, now is still constant. So if you are walking in the forest and you are also in meditation, you are in now in two dimensions simultaneously, earth realm, forest, and etheric realm, meditation. You can find yourself at a kind of crossroads of earth and etheric and find now there. Wherever you go, there you are. This includes wherever you find yourself in earth reality and wherever you travel in etheric realms across all dimensions. So you always have the ability ability to calibrate yourself to now which is present moment whatever dimensions you are traveling in and even when you are existing in several dimensions at once when are we not in now we're always in now but we can forget this we have to keep remembering to be present we have to keep remembering we're soul so when we're in one place, but our mind is another, we are not present. Spiraling in memory, rehashing the past, fantasizing or projecting into the future are all ways we are not in now. So are all kinds of distractions and drama. How can we get to now instantly? Some people like to use the breath. It's a very quick bridge, just a few times and you're there. Some people like to ground. 
And if that works for you, do that. Or you can just take a pause and become aware. Let's just do that now. And in the pause, the question is, what's really happening? What's actually occurring? What is temporary and unimportant? What is infinite and lasting? All or any of these will calibrate you to now. It's a very interesting concept, this idea of nowness, not just in be here now, here I am in earth reality, but this idea of finding now in all the dimensions that you might be journeying in. You go into your dream, you find you're now there. You think about the past memory, you find you're now there. You think about the future, you find you're now. You do meditation, you do yoga, where you're you're finding yourself, your soul self in other dimensionalities, and yet you find yourself in now easily, no matter where you are. What it means, of course, is the soul is, the soul is only now. You know, we've heard this before, but it's a different way of thinking about it when you think that no matter what dimension is you were in, you can always find your way home to now, to present moment, to present experience. Thank you for listening to Divine Astrology. You can subscribe and get this every month. You can go to the website, sarahweisman.com. And um, we also have our free mini course, The Magic of Blind Readings, which people are seeming to like. So you can sign up for that there too. Thanks for listening. See you next month.